hey guys how are you i hope you all are doing good and today in this video we are having a look on the latest version of havoc os which is the havoc os version 4.12 as you can see here and it is based on the android 11 the security patch is latest 5 december 2021 and as you can see here i have installed it on my redmi note 8 and in the last of video i will show you how you can install it on your redmi note 8 and note 8t so without any further ado let's get started so first of all let me show you that uh, this device is based on uh, sorry this rom is based on android 11 as you can see here let me decrease uh, the brightness a little bit and uh, its version is 4.12 based on latest security patch and of course you can install any custom kernel right now it is uh, working with the stock kernel and uh, other than that everything is just pretty much smooth as you know the work OS is one of my favorite ROM and uh, I hope you will also like this ROM so in the camera we have this MIUI camera pre-installed right here and it is pretty much good it is taking photos recording videos and uh, everything is just working fine and you can also install uh, Google camera or any custom camera as you can see here I have installed this latest custom uh, gcam but it is not working because i have not installed uh, or enabled the camera to api and uh, this rom comes with two variants first one is the vanilla build and second one is the google apps build i have installed the g apps build as you can see here it comes with the all necessary google applications like google play store calendar and uh, contacts uh, and all other applications and the ROM is pretty stable, there is no any single bug or issue. As you can see here, the ROM is pretty much clean, as you already know. So if you swipe from the left, uh, you can get your uh, Google feeds. And you can also add some widgets, you can manage the styles and wallpapers. Uh, on the device, we only have this wallpaper pre-installed. But don't worry, you can install a lot of wallpapers because the Google My Wallpaper application is already installed. Now you can access to the styles. Mm, one style is installed, which is the default. But don't worry, you can create your own by clicking on the custom button. You can manage the clocks right from here for your lock screen. Let's try this one. And it looks pretty much awesome, isn't it? So now let's dig into the settings. There is not uh, uh, some major changes in the uh, settings. Everything is pretty much same. It is asking to enable the dark mode. And uh, I just turned it on. As you can see here, how cool it looks uh, with this room. Then we have confi uh, configuration center. From here, you can uh, make changes in your status bar. And you can also enable the logo which I have already in, uh, enabled as you can see here you can change its style blogger or uh, anything emoji dead door uh, anything you want after it we have some brightness controls and double tap to sleep and other settings you can also in, uh, change the battery style right from here and uh, you can also enable the text and you can also enable the battery bar after it we have quick settings settings lock screen settings from here you can enable double tap to wake and uh, uh, other things you can also in uh, change the value of background blur for the lock screen as you can see here it looks pretty much awesome and uh, after it we have the ambient display always on display is also present in this room and it looks pretty much awesome but it gonna drain your battery quickly because we don't have the amulet display so let me turn it off after it we have the buttons and navigation then we have gestures in the gestures we have quickly open camera system navigation bar and from here you can enable any navigation style you want and you can also hide the navigation bar pill from here and it will take a few seconds okay after it we have uh, prevent ringing power menu uh, quick torch and uh, skip uh, music tracks and swipe three fingers to screenshot after it we have notification battery saving options screen media option and the misc we have the advanced gaming mode 
if you are a gamer uh, must try this feature then we have about because this is a uh, official build so you can expect the uh, official updates after it we have the battery the battery performance of this rom is pretty much awesome and uh, here we also have the battery saver adaptive charging then we have display in this display uh, we have all sa uh, same settings from previous builds then we have sound storage privacy location security in the security we have all security options like face unlock fingerprint all screen uh, locks are available then we have accounts accessibility digital well-being google system in this system we have languages and input date and time backup rules reset option multiple users system update and xiaomi parts in the xiaomi parts here is my favorite uh, feature which is the me sound enhancer you can enable it and you can also uh, change some display color collaborations by going into the disk settings you can also use the clear speaker and you can also enable usb fast charging so the rom is pretty much stable there is no any single bug or issue in this rom you can use it as your daily driver and if you want to use it as your daily driver then just download the rom from the link in the description and reboot your device into an installed recovery now how you can reboot your device into the recovery just shut down your mobile phone and press and hold power button plus volume up button and it will take you to the team will or any recovery you have installed on your phone just go to wipe before installing the new rom you need to uh, wipe your old rom just wipe all these partitions except internal storage and sd card as you can see here just wipe right from here after wiping go back to home i'm not wiping because i, I have already installed this rom uh, go to install and from here then we select internal storage from here just select the havoc os 4.12 install it right from here after installing uh, make sure to install the disable dm variety if you are uh, using team will recovery or uh, orange fox recovery because it gonna encrypt your uh, storage and you can also flash the magix manager if you want to root your rom just go back to home click on reboot click on system and in a few minutes the rom will be booted up on your redmi note 8 and note 8t so hope you guys like this video if you really did hit the like button don't forget to subscribe my channel keep supporting thanks for watching peace